Hello, I would like to thank you for taking the time to listen to me today. To all of our teachers, administrators, and educators watching, I'm Larry Macon Jr. I currently serve as the pastor of Mount Zion Church of Oakwood Village, where I have led at the executive and ministerial level for over 15 years. Also, with a congregation of 6,000 members, I have just been so blessed to reside in the village of Oakwood. I've also had the privilege of studying law as I earned my Juris Doctor from the Florida A&M College of Law. During my stint in the legal field, I worked in community legal services in the field of diversity where I was helping people who were underserved and they were tenants in disputes with their landlords for the Orange County in the state of Florida. I've also served as a diversity dialogue consultant and also the Director of Multicultural Affairs for the University of Central Florida. In those roles, I was given the opportunity to train students and faculty in the field of diversity and inclusion and to carry out the university's role in becoming one of the largest and most diverse colleges in the United States with an enrollment of over 69,000 students. Currently, I serve as the Vice Chairman of the Board of Trustees for Central State University right outside of Dayton, Ohio. And I also am the co-host of the morning show on WKYC Channel 3. The show is called It's About You, where I highlight individuals who are doing great things in our community through interviews and news reporting on local television. And now I'm excited to be partnering with my former school district as an alumni of Bedford City Schools as a consultant in the field of diversity and inclusion. In this role, the superintendent has asked me to aid in the planning and coordination of various ideas around equity and diversity concerning staff, students, and families. Offering guidance, creating positive partnerships, and eventually create a strategic plan for many years to come. Some of you may ask, what does this field cover? Well, it provides coordination, consultation, guidance, support, and assistance to schools in working with parents and families. We assist and help you understand the needs of low income, culturally and or linguistically diverse students and families. We assist in mediating between parents and student concerns. We give internal consultations on multicultural concerns. We are a support system in the field of diversity. To sum it all up, we make sure that no child is left behind, no child is misunderstood, and everyone is getting a fair shake, no matter what their background, preference, or challenges may be. We want to make you, our leaders and teachers of the next generation, more confident in the way that you communicate and in the way in which you deal with a diverse group of student constituents. But today we are going to deal with social justice. As many of you know, this topic has been on the forefront of our news during this year and has been in our country for a while, a very touchy subject. The administration has come up with a mantra of Bearcats building bridges to social justice, which characterizes their mission of inspiring change through courageous conversations. If we don't dialogue, we'll never learn what we are all thinking. And if we don't know what each other are thinking, we will never be able to change things for the better. So today, we are going to have some dialogue on the subject of social justice based upon the critically acclaimed Netflix movie, American Son. So to give you a good definition of social justice, remember it means this. It means to have the view that everyone, and I mean everyone, deserves equal economic, political, and social rights and opportunities. So as we fight for equality among all, let us remember the saying, happy are those who maintain justice and do what's right. So at this time, we'll watch American Son, and then we'll have a joint discussion with questions given to some of your peers, and also then we will have open forum where we can all talk and comment and debrief on this very important subject based upon this movie. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you after the movie.